What's happening YouTube? What's up guys? Right, today I am changing the ESC on this WL Toys 10428. Right then guys, as I just mentioned, I'm changing the ESC on you. Uh, me and my son have gone out for the day and obviously we've taken this Will Toys Extreme and burnt the ESC out. Uh, here is the ESC. I am very pleased that it's been posted today and my son is due here on Saturday which he will be doing um, an unboxing as well on a, another car uh, but it's got four wheel steer and it's got F, FPV which you can actually put goggles on and, and see where it goes and it's also got a built in camera on it as well but that'll be the next unboxing that me and my son is doing but I'm going to surprise him by basically taking this apart um, obviously I've got a range of tools for you and I'm going to try and sort this uh, this this problem out. Um, as you can see here, this is the controller it comes with, and you've got four left and right. But unfortunately, there's nothing at all going back and forth. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to actually take the cage off now, start it, um, take the ESC out, and exchange it. I also will be doing that the same as well with another Will Toys car, and also there is wheel upgrades to go on that, just like this one and yeah guys stay tuned i really really appreciate it if you want to leave any comments hit that subscribe and notification bell so you don't miss the next um unboxing airsoft fingers crossed guys i hope this airsoft will uh, get back to normal sooner or later because well it's getting boring being on uh, on lockdown anyway here's the range of tools i got i got a cutter i got a door um i got a door card remover Basically, that should be alright to put the ESC and obviously prise it out without doing any damage. I got some tie wraps, a cutter, a black and decker screwdriver which has been converted. So obviously the Allen key will fit. And I also got a little baby um, adjustable spanner. So um, right then guys, further ado, let's get on with it. seem to be a little bit different um, they're all the same size Allen key but obviously they are kind of like slightly different shape in uh, in length to be honest right then there's the ESC that I need to actually remove so let's go with this and see if I can get that underneath it and prise it up There we go, there's the EC removed. The ESC and do these. And also this one. So fingers crossed, hopefully this is all the problem is the ESC there's a there's diamonds, not the mock down. So we'll uh, 
sniff test to see if it's actually burnt out, guys. Um, that would have to be removed off here, I think. It's glued on it quite nicely. Okay. Alright, let's just see if this one actually works. Be very interesting now to see. Okay, as you can see, it's slightly different. This one has actually got a power switch that goes onto the back of the car, and this one has a power switch on top of it. And it's slightly, slightly bit bigger. Um, but in theory, everything looks exactly the same, I think. So I uh, saw so that one, two, three, four, five pins. Three, four, five. As you can see here, uh, I just counted them there. There and there. Um, right, let's just see and plug and play, see if everything works, fingers crossed. Okay, so just hold down. Right, that fitted in quite nicely. Now let's put these in. Okay. Now I will connect this to the battery. It's only too light bulb. And switch this on and then obviously then if everything's working correctly I'll just uh, put it on the body of the car and stick it all down. And that'll be these. My son can actually take it out then and uh, have some quality time doing a bit of crawling. So okay. Right, we had instant movement on the front with front wheels. So I'm going to turn the control on and see if it links in, which hopefully it should. Okay, seems to have an issue with you a second. So let's turn this off. It should actually pick it up, no problem. Probably will soon see now. Okay, I think it's searching now to actually uh, pick up the frequency. Possibly. Hmm. Right, unfortunately, I can't seem to be getting it working. So let's just check a second. So Okay guys, clearly at this point um, I realised that the ESC was not for this model car, it was for the 10428 wild truck, uh, which obviously the internals is slightly different because obviously you've got a gear ratio in that one and this one you haven't, so the two ESCs are completely different and further investigation I found with the Will Toys 10428 extreme truck is that the actual motor was burned out, so I put an order in for that. And obviously the ESC then got transferred out to this uh, extreme track and passed over to the wild track because the ESC in the wild track 10428 was actually burned out.